Internet. It's leap day, folks. I hope you're enjoying your extra day this year, probably spending it working, but I'm sure you're also wondering, why exactly do we have leap years? There's actually a lot that goes into it. Let's talk about it. You already know that the leap year happens every four years. That is because the solar year and the calendar year do not match up. A solar year, or the actual time it takes the Earth to revolve around the sun, is 365.2422 days, not quite the standard 365 days in a calendar year. And the difference between these year types can actually start to add up. The extra 0.2422 days is equivalent to 5.8 hours, so every year we're falling behind 5.8 hours. And over a period of 100 years, we would be behind 24 whole days from the actual solar calendar. So you just add in an extra day every four years. Problem solved, right? With a leap day in place, it still isn't quite right. Over a period of 100 years, we'd still be 18 hours off from the actual solar year. So there are some extra rules that you may not have heard of to help offset this difference. We actually skip a leap year if it falls on the start of a century, unless that year is divisible by 400. It's still not perfect, however. With this rule in place, we're still over 25.9 seconds each year, but it would take 3,333 years to be off by one day. 